10th of April 2024. Hello everybody. Albina Baklikova, Sergey Baklikov. This is Baklikov live from the uh, village called Rapino, named after the great Russian artist, painter Ilya Repin. Not far from here, there's located his dacha called Penate. There's the museum now. And this is uh, Primorske Chasse, Primorske Highway. Primorske means near the sea. And really, in about like 50 meters from here, there's the Gulf of Finland, which is a part of uh, Baltic Sea. And now we came here for our traditional spring walk along the coastline of the Gulf of Finland. Uh, from like uh, Repino all the way to Komarova village. It's interesting, but this is considered to be a part of uh, St. Petersburg area. This is uh, the villages. These are the villages of um, the Kurortny districts of St. Petersburg. Kurortny means the resource. Yes, historically, this is like the resource. Look, this area used to be developed as the resource. Resource. Yeah, the pinery. A beautiful pinery everywhere. A beautiful pinery along the... Uh, um, Gulf of Finland, you see Pinate, okay, it's closed now, and probably we will not be able to go inside, yes, it's closed now, but look, Pinate, Ilya Repin, Dacia is there, yes, historically, historically, this area used to be a uh, developed as the Dacia community, Dacia community for like uh, wealthy people, the uh, nobility and different merchants. Everybody who had enough of money, they were constructing their duchess, their summer houses here. Yeah? Well. And now it's not the exception. It's not the exception. Actually, now it's considered as kind of expensive area too. Expensive area in terms of the real estate. <clears throat> Hi, Michael Portnoy, Silvana Hori, Artem Prudnikov, Daniel Klingenberg, Rupert, Carlos, George Berdas, Marsha, 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 Rupert, Swelling Sausage, Sophie Daniels, Ultra 87. Hi, guys. Enjoy this. Right now, I gotta go to uh, the Gulf of Finland. Today, we will walk all the way along the Gulf of Finland. By the way, here around you can find a lot of uh, so-called ecological roads or ecological paths, path, path, you know, ecological path. And uh, also some uh, bicycle lanes, you know, though here it's like prohibited uh, to ride a bicycle or what? No, it's not prohibited. I mean, that's misleading. Look, here is the, the bicycle, but there are no bicycle. What? <clears throat> Susan Foster, hello. Okay, let's get to the Gulf of Finland. Also, everywhere you can find such a big stones. But I think here are the big stones in order not to, allow, not to allow the cars to go further. Uh, yes, beautiful. 
It's beautiful. And even the sun is shining today. It's like half cloudy, half sunny. Nice day. I like it. And uh, I can easily say that the air is absolutely different here than in this city. It's plus 14 degrees Celsius, plus 13. Well, already plus 13. But it was like up to almost 20 today in the daytime. Natalia Khramieva, hello. Hello, everybody. Welcome to a beautiful coastline of the Gulf of Finland. Look at this. I'll be going towards the sunset. I hope so. If uh, the clouds will not close the sun, I think we will reach it. <clears throat> How do you like it? Ladies and gentlemen, how do you like it? Look at this. So, if you now will check the map, you will see that uh, I and Alvina will take a walk from Repino to Komarovo. We will meet some of the uh, hotels right on the coast. It's like about even up to two months in the year when it's possible to swim here. The water is warm enough that to swim here oh nice nice i think we came in a great time last year i remember we came here it's also it was mostly frozen but no it's not frozen but still still some snow though so this is epic this is epic so look st petersburg is all the way Or maybe this is Kronstadt. Yeah, it seems like St. Petersburg is somewhere there. You know, today it's taken for us only uh, one hour, one hour to come from the very center of St. Petersburg to here. The Gulf of Finland, a part of Baltic Sea. Yes, if you will take a boat now, you can how to say swim you can cruise all the way to finland to sweden Noise, noise. Sail, okay, yes, yeah, sail. Probably sail going to be a uh, right word. I don't know, looks, li looks like somebody's private property because on the map, it's not says that it's hotel but if it's somebody's private property then it's going to be really expensive because i mean look at this this is right next to the gulf of finland gosh hello cowboy roy rogers akash roy mark patterson I don't know if we will see a picturesque sunset today though because look I saw some sun but now it's covered by the clouds however 
it's going to be a nice walk along the Gulf of Finland. I love it. <clears throat> Today I'm just in my hoodie. It's finally pretty warm in St. Petersburg. It was up to plus 20 degrees Celsius by day to day. Now it's already almost 6.30. Genius Skinner, nice. Enjoy, everybody, enjoy. Yes, our, our, our traditional trip to the Gulf of Finland in the middle of the spring. <coughs> See this? Hi, Diego Rodriguez. Где? Похоже, да? Ну а зачем ты ее взяла? Я же тебе сказал, не нужно мне. Ну не нужно мне. Зачем ты меня не слушаешь? А потом, это, а потом ставишь перед фактом, что мне нужно надеть. Я Нордбоу, hello. Ким Фераглия. Нет, я просто не понимаю. Ну, я ну, просто не понимаю, я сказал. You see some ice some snow here and so I wonder if those are the seagulls there no it looks like a ravens not seagulls you see that Uh, also along the Gulf of Finland here goes the suburban train suburban trains looks like an old hotel an old resort hotel It seems like it is inactive now because I also don't see don't see that on the map. Yeah, cr cr crows. Yes, crows. I wonder if there is actually the difference between ravens and crows. Nice. Yeah, it's really interesting to see the crows, but not to hear the seagulls. Usually, oh no, I hear the seagull. Hi, VJ Bumblebee. Yes, Soviet Times Hotel. I don't know, maybe they will make the reconstruction of it, renovation or maybe they will demolish it but recently uh, there's it's a, it's a further all the way to the northwest there's going to be a really big resort recently the president of Russia Vladimir Putin he uh, accepted the beginning of the development 
of a uh, big resort here on the Gulf of Finland <clears throat> in Sestrobretsk. Vladimir Akhramiev, Komarova. I was in a summer camp when I was at school for two months. Nice! I hope it gives you a good memories now. Komarov был в лагере. Ты зайди, посмотри, отмотай. Нет. Во-первых, он на карте не указан. Во-вторых, видно же, что он никаких занавесок, ничего нету. Мне кажется, дальше, да. Он, наверное. Hello, Gina Marcaccio. You're in Feather, California. I'm sure there's much warmer now than here. But for, for St. Petersburg, this is considered as the resort. Yeah, so relatively to St. Petersburg, this is like the resort and really here is a lot of a lot of hotels along the Gulf of Finland from the side of Russia from the side of St. Petersburg and uh, they are not they are not cheap at all however however almost always they have the sold outs Two hundred forty-two people online. Nice, nice. Enjoy the pinery. Enjoy the Gulf of Finland. <clears throat> nice. I just said that recently Putin accepted the beginning of the construction of a big resort here on the Gulf of Finland. But also today he said that in St. Petersburg they need to start developing a uh, speed line to Pulkova airport, including the continue of metro line to Pulkova airport. This is something what is already was done in Moscow. The Moscow, Moscow's Vnukova airport, or should I say, airport of Vnukova in September 2023, there was opened the first in the world metro station right under the airport. <clears throat> Gosh, look, uh, this is really interesting as it seems like it was all uh, just uh, moved here by the waves. Hello, good fella. Hello, Yarmo Marcos Jara. Zrinkov Ranges. 
Yes, Zrinko, the popular Russian song called Komarova на недельку до второго я уеду Комарова. That's exactly about this Komarova. Komarova, we are going to. Yeah, this is really interesting now to see all this ice on the uh, coast of the Gulf of Finland already like in the middle of the spring this is actually already the middle of the spring not even an early spring another look I, I, I think that last year we were coming here a little bit earlier than now than we came now Young biker. Quadros cycles. Nice. The guys are enjoying. The kids of big shots enjoying it seems. As I told you, the area, the area here around uh, the east state here, the, uh, the east state here in Repina and all this coastline, not cheap, not cheap. Normal. High bar on Saturday. High circle absent, detect ripens. Absolutely great walk. And it's so fresh here. So fresh. Yeah, this is really interesting that all this ice was naturally thrown on the coast. It's a romantic vibe here. That's why from time to time you can meet more pairs walking around. Race one. Well, that's awesome scenery. Yes, it is. No, 
nice. I was missing this St. Petersburg countryside sceneries. Is that how thick the snow was? Not really, not really. It wasn't that thick, but it seems like the waves recently bring it on the shore. But the ice definitely wasn't that thick, no way. High armored tree, high heave channel. Thank you for a great video. So nice to get out of the city for a while. That's true, that's true, especially after a kind of long winter. <clears throat> Hi, Max Belkin. It's just a little bit windy, but the wind is so warm, already warm and fresh. Now, right here. Hello, I am Jeffrey. Hello and goodbye. Yeah, what an idiot. if we are talking just about a normal fishing
little barb fur. We'll find a narrow place. <clears throat> Somebody's having a picnic. Noise. There it is. But need to be careful. Okay, done. Hello Tamara, Tamara words. If you're asking, if you're asking what is my phone? So look, you're really asking, you're really telling that the quality is amazing. And in the same time you're asking if it's Android or iPhone. I mean, a great quality equal iPhone. So this is iPhone. to find the place where we can cross another creek what the hell gosh а блин я то могу сюда перепрыгнуть но вот ты я не знаю В этом дело, то, что это не женское дело, вот так вот скакать. А тут, смотри. Ну вот по этим камням можно. Очень аккуратно. Но видишь, тут скользко может быть. И можно навернуться. Вот здесь, а дальше, вот если по лесу пойти, думаешь, значит, там найдем, вот туда 
Думаю, да. Дюс, let's give it a try. So that's it. And that is already a, an active hotel. And there's another one. Alpha Finland wins freedom are perfect. Oh yes. <coughs> Hi Helen Brown. Mark Patterson, the temperature is plus 13 Celsius and I have no idea how much it is in Fahrenheit because here in Russia we use just a normal, normal metrics for the weather.
It is also a nice exercise now walking by the sand. I mean, it's some harder to walk the sand than just a normal round. The restaurant, it's called Zalif. The Bay restaurant bar. It's going to be hard though. The hotel, it seems it's called Crystal, based on my Yandex map. And this is Repinske Hotel. Some ice is still here. Two. Tak, tak, tak. And there's the Ghidra foil or should I say no it's not Ghidra foil it's uh, called Hoovercraft this is the boat that can ride the ice because it moves Thankful to this huge fan. <clears throat> the rescue service of St. Petersburg. Oh, this is the rescue station, look, the rescue station number 13, all right, nice. <coughs> Repinske Hotel. What does the inside of the boat look like? It looked nice. Oh, 
hydros. Sergey, I do like your hats. This is the same hat as I have in a red color. I like it too. You guys check out Repinske Hotel. Not too cheap. Can you swim in that water during summer or it will be too cold? As I said before, about two months, a year, July, August, maybe even June. Yes, it is possible to swim here. Looks like a dense floor. Look. I love the look of such a stones. We will not be able to meet the sunset, it's too cloudy. Unfortunately, yes. Unfortunately, it seems like we will not be able to see a full-scale sunset today. Anyway, it's pretty nice here, pretty nice. The vibe of the Gulf of Finland of Baltic Sea. Александр Эй, отличная прогулка. Спасибо, Сергей. Спасибо, Александр. Наслаждайтесь.
got to the restaurant. The restaurant it's called Majestic Look at this cloud. And look, there's the road. That's Primorske Chasse, Primorske Highway. Next week, Baklik of Life on a boat. Yeah, most probably. The navigation must be started in a few days from now. Armalji, thank you for the super chats. I swam in the Baltic in August 2019. I loved it. Barley, salty water.
I know it's enjoyable to ride the Gulf of Finland. the new constructions. The bus stop so here you may come by bus by train by car There's another restaurant. So as you can see, as you can see the Gulf of Finland uh, full of restaurants in the romantic places where you can come for a dinner. Noise. Just the buses directly from St. Petersburg. Thank you for taking this walk along the beach. Beautiful nature. I knew you guys will enjoy this. Beautiful nature and also nice exercise for me. Well, I mean, look, this sand. But nice, I need to dump some kilograms Hi Rock Ivanov
high to South Africa. No, we don't go fishing. Do you see anything about fishing in the title or in the description of the video? Or did you see the roads in my hands? Hi, Eva Barbara, Greta B, Alexander Atom. Anvert 13, hello. Oh, the rain started. Yeah, that's, that's what it means, the Baltics. The weather is so unpredictable. When I came here, it was yet a little bit of sun, then sun was closed with such a dark clouds, and now the rain begins. Gosh. I hope the rain is not going gonna go wild. You see, meanwhile, there we can even see something like the sun. Yeah, there there was the sun just an hour ago when I started. Well, we actually can see the roots of the trees.
another private house right on the coast of the Gulf of Finland which is nice Another creek. Hi, Gun Anderson. Yeah, great weather, but it's almost like a nice weather. Well, this is kind of nice weather, anyway. I mean, it's warm, it's not that windy, it's fresh. For this... For these places, it's yet a nice weather. Even though it's gray, it's gray but great. Another restaurant. If you will open the map, you will see lots of restaurants. It's called Rapino Village. Seems like geographically we are still in Rapino, but next to Rapino there goes Komarova. George, same and same and same, show us something new. Dude, dude, this is just a coast of the Gulf of Finland, okay? And uh, you see, I literally walk all around and uh, show everything here. If you're just like, all the nature looks the same, it looks the same. How can I show this something new to you? Of course, it will be about the same. It's just the sea. 
It's the pinery. Nice. Oh, look, maybe we'll get lucky and we'll get some sun out. In the nearest time, actually not that far until the, the official dusk. George Berdas, thank you for the super sticker. <clears throat> and this is the restaurant which is called Nasha Dacha. Our Dacha. It looks awesome. In fact, it looks in the style of pre-revolutionary wooden brick dachas here. Recently, when I was in Vyritsa, the village of Vyritsa, in Leningrad region, saw a lot of such a pre-revolutionary dachas. I'm not sure if this is a brand new building or it is rebuilt out of existed dacha here. I don't know. But it looks cool anyway. And nice terrace. Another restaurant called Villa Verde. Meanwhile, the local time 7.35. Tracy Smith, very beautiful. Oh, enjoy, enjoy.
mais. And here I already that far from the Russian fishing restaurant, which is already located in Komarovo, Komarovo village. The parking for the guests of the restaurants You see, it's really right next to the highway In exactly this area uh, The highway goes really close to the Gulf of Finland The restaurant Kalakolne Gorka Abel Hill same hour as St. Petersburg. Good Anderson, yes, but not always. In the winter time, it's different for one hour. That's because Finland switching to the winter time and Russia is not anymore since 2007. <coughs> or maybe 2013. I forgot. By the way, if you've noticed, a good internet coverage everywhere. Well, it's an open space here and seems like LTE signal goes pretty well all along the coast.
And that's it. Here we came to the restaurant Russian Fishing. This is one of the restaurants that used to belong to Evgeny Prigozhin. Now together with Albina, we're gonna get some tea there. And then we will wait for the bus to come back to Repino, where our car parked. I think it was nice 90 minutes walk. There was the George, there was George who complained that it was all the same. But I think this is ridiculous because we just were walking all along the uh, coast of the Gulf of Finland. Just enjoys the nature of Leningrad region, which is technically still St. Petersburg, the resort district of St. Petersburg. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. See you tomorrow. Albina Baklikova. Hi. Sergey Baklikov. Baklikov live from the coast line of the Gulf of Finland, <laughs> which is a part of Baltic Sea. Resort districts of St. Petersburg, Russia. Bye, guys. I know you saw a lot of this today, but I, I can't stand not to make the final beautiful panorama. Have a great day.